Okay, so today for my two cents, I am going to show you a problem that many people have. If you have Time Warner, AOL, or uh, all-in-one cable box, then chances are you have one of these. Maybe it looks different, but this will take your cable, your phone, whatever, run it on one. Now, the cable screws into the back. and this is your router so all of you are like how the heck do I hook up my wireless router from my cable well first off you're gonna do a lot of unplugging and plugging back in of each of these but let me bring you a quick crash course okay that one is the cable line see how the cable screws into it then you have the Ethernet, which is this big cable right here. Then you have the power cord. Okay. When you're starting, just leave it unplugged. Now, take the Ethernet cord and you put it in the one that says modem. Right there. It's the one there's four of them on there and then there's one by itself the one by itself is your main internet connection so let me get this a breakdown so you understand your internet comes through here from the cable company you're just putting it from there to here and saying hey broadcast me so this laptop can pick up the internet now after you connect that cable, the Ethernet cable, to this, the wireless router, then you connect a cable just like the wireless, just like the Ethernet cable, that thick phone line looking one. You connect it right to the back where your Ethernet is, where your internet usually comes in if you don't have a wireless connection. Now, after you do that, you just put in the install CD where it will bring you up to par on everything. Do it yourself. It'll have you set in a key and everything. So basically, if you can remember that when in doubt, unplug that and reset it. All you got to do is unplug it, count to five, plug it back in. Unplug it, count to five, plug it back in. If you have any problem and it doesn't work correctly. Now, if you need any other help, feel free to leave a message. I'll give a more detailed explanation. But I have a hard time figuring out what people don't understand about this. Go to Walmart. Buy this in the store for 40 bucks. Come home. Take it out of the box. Set it up. Take the one Ethernet cord. Plug it from the cable to that then you'll have another ethernet cord lying around somewhere take it from there run it to the back of your laptop or PC run the software that you stick right in here in your CD drive, DVD drive okay so long story short cable company goes to the wireless router wireless router broadcasts it plus it's also a router which means you'll still be able to take a regular ethernet cable and one of those four holes that are together and plug it to things like this or the PC or something without wireless. Now, what's the benefit of wireless? You can wire one computer, two computers, you can wire your Wii, you can wire your Nintendo DS Lite, your PSP, all to a wireless network. What's the great part about a wireless network? it's wireless you can go a thousand feet a hundred feet wherever you want and as soon as it's done you'll have your own connection I named mine connected signal strength all set up that's all you have to do people any questions feel free to ask but that's my two cents it's as simple as that one more time Ethernet cord to there. Right to the only single connection, not the four together. 
just the one outlet. It says internet, then you take that, wire it to here, set up the CD, we'll walk you through the rest. That's it. Put in your own password, ta-da, you're done. Okay, that's my two cents. Take care.